Hello guys, Keep Brothers on TV here, back for yet another video. Before we get into this video, let's see if we can hit 100 likes. And if you haven't already, make sure to drop us up. I actually went to this game, by the way. Um, it's finished. Birmingham City nil, Blackburn Rovers won. The match review will be out a bit later tonight due to the fact that I went to the game. So yeah, we've lost 1-0 at home to Blackburn. An own goal from Trusty has knocked us out. Wow. Wow. So yeah, getting on to the game, of course, the lineup we went with average in goal. We had a back three of Long, Trusty and Sanderson. And then we had um, Longello coming back into the starting 11. Of course, he's actually our player. Now we've signed him on a permanent basis. That means that the um that we only have we only have um five loan players now instead of six, I believe. So that means um we don't have to keep leaving out a loan player every single match day to um fit in all the loan players so that's that's good a bit a good bit of business from blues on deadline day four hundred thousand pounds um I'll, I'll probably be doing another video on that and uh, might be coming out tomorrow so yeah long the left wing back colin uh as the right wing back the three in the middle chang started this game um we also had bakuna and hannibal starting and then we had um kadra and scott hogan up top now the first minute or so bakuna he was doing all these fancy fancy skills, fancy tricks. It worked in the first minute, and he tried it a couple of other times in the whole game, and it did not work. The first 30 minutes or so, it, you know, Blackburn were controlling the game. They had um, more shots than us. We found it hard to get the ball out of our own half in the first 30 minutes. But after, like, the 30 minutes, after, like, the 30-minute period, we come into the game. Kadro was... Kadra looked lively. It was the first time watching him live, and he looked lively. He was taking two or three players on at once. Um, yeah, brilliant play, absolutely brilliant play. I'm just, I'm, I'm just. It's just a shame that he's not our player. He's on loan um, with us. But yeah, um, you know, Kadra lights the game up for Blues. Like I said, the first first minutes were very poor from Blues. But how many times was Longello out out wide? He was literally unmarked and instead of you know trying to do a long ball to Longello he could he had all the time in the world to sprint forward but we just passed the ball backwards and backwards the crowd was getting frustrated to be fair but yeah nil nil at the break the second half much better from Blues um, I remember when um, Blackburn hit the post we had so many chances I think that we should have won this game I thought we was the better side and that's just not being. That's just not me being biased. I thought Hannibal as well. By the way, let's just make what has I think Hannibal. What has gone on with him? Um, you know, he was giving the ball away a lot of times. I think he had a, a poor game. To be fair, um, so yeah, Longello, right, Longello. Yeah, I don't know how Scott uh, Scott Hogan is missing this. By the way, Longello puts in a ball, and it was easier. It was easier to miss. I mean, it was harder. It was harder to harder to harder to miss. Sorry, I don't know how Scott Hogan has missed that. What has, that's another another player as well, Scott Hogan. What has what has gone on with him? Um, you know, since he's had that injury, he's gone back to his um, usual self, not being able to put the ball into into the back of the net. Um, we had a clear penalty as well um, in the last minute of extra time. Turned down. Yukovic come on um, for Kadra and he actually did cause problems. Long had a shot where he just literally tapped it, put absolutely no power into the shot whatsoever. And um, yeah, Yukovic also had a shot that just went wide at the post. But the main talking point really in this game was the own goal from Austin Trusty. The ball is put into the box from a Blackburn player. Okay, Trusty, I think he was trying to kick it out for a corner. But he was absolutely he was under absolutely no pressure. I don't believe anyway there was no Blackburn player near him. And he puts it into his own net and we lose the game in extra time and we fail to qualify for the fifth round of the FA Cup. We're not going to be playing Leicester away. But I do think I do think this is harsh on blues really. I you know what as well, Gary Garner coming on coming on. I thought Nico Gordon should have started in, started instead of Long and I thought Gary Garner should have, uh, should have started, sorry, instead of Chang, in my opinion. Um, Kadra was taken off for Yukovic. To be fair, like, yes, 
the league is more important. But I mean, I, I don't think we should have took off our best player. Jordan Graham, come on, um, didn't really make much of an impact. Really, he didn't really have that much time. To be fair, he was he was bored time with him like within like five minutes left of the game. So yeah, um, I'm a bit gutted to be fair to be knocked out of the FA Cup. It would have been a, a repeat of the 2025th round game we had um, away at Leicester. But yeah, um, positives from Blues. I thought we looked a bit better this game. You know, we had a lot of shots on target. Um, but Yukovic also had, by the way, he also had a shot which just went wide at the post. It just wasn't our night. It wasn't our night. Um, and a bit of luck. A bit of misfortune, really, with that trusty own goal. Um, I don't really think trusty deserves a stick. You know, mad things can happen in football. Things can happen in football. But, yeah, anyway, it's Mikey Brett on TV. Make sure to like, share, and also subscribe, subscribe to the channel. Sorry. Let's see if we can hit 100 likes. Thanks for watching, guys. Let me know what you thought of the game down below in the comments. And, uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Keep on.